Developing tonight, a mother now facing charges after her child was found shot to death in the back of her car. CBS 46's Sawyer Bussey joins us live now. And Sawyer, somehow that child got a hold of a gun. That's right. In the last hour, we actually received some new information. Police believe the mother left her gun loaded underneath the driver's side seat of the car. They say her daughter found it and lost her life. The family tells me it feels like they lost two people this weekend. Along I-85 North at North Druid Hills Road on Sunday night around 730. That's when police say they found four year old Kendall Lewis dead in a car. Police tell us they believe Kendall found a gun in the back seat of a car and fired it. Family, the community, it has a ripple effect. Kendall's mother, 26 year old Kaylin Lewis, is now behind bars. The family left to deal with two unfathomable situations. These are always the most tragic situations when children are affected. One of the missions of Moms Demand Action is to prevent tragedies like the one police believe happened to Kindle from happening to other families. They advocate for safe gun storage. You have to be responsible. With great power comes great responsibility and you have to lock up your gun in your car get a, car, a gun safe no matter what that kids cannot get into. According to the Moms Demand Action website, every year nearly 700 children, 17 and under, die by suicide with a gun. 4.6 million American children live in homes with guns that are both loaded and unlocked. It can happen to anybody. Stoddard's Range and Guns here in Georgia sells car safes for your gun people having the right to own a firearm, but we're also about their having the obligation to store it safely, to learn how to use it safely. They're easy to use. Um, they are designed to be discreet and go with you wherever you are. The safes today open with a fingerprint. Uh, they can open with your phone. Um, so they're, they're made to be very accessible very quickly. And advocates with Moms Demand Action say they can save lives. It's easy to hear a story like this one and think this could never happen to my family, but advocates say it can happen to anyone. Gun safe prices vary. They can be less than 40 bucks or more than 200. Sawyer Bussey, CBS 46 News.